I'm Poppy and you're watching Poppy Does Science. Hi, the story behind this experiment is almost as strange as the experiment itself. It was discovered by a man called, called Steve Mould, who was looking for a way to demonstrate how self siphoning polymers work. While using a chain to demonstrate how they flow, he discovered that the beads went up and above the beaker, just like this. was he didn't know why it behaved like this. So a few million YouTube views later it was generally accepted that it, con it continues to flow because of gravity. The floor is lower than the beaker and the dropping part is longer than the bit in the beaker making it heavier so gravity pulls down harder which drives the floor. But this still didn't explain why the chain rolls over the beaker. Professor Mark Warner and Dr John Gibbons from the Cambridge University decided to carry out a study into what they called the mould effect. They discovered that the chin can be only bent so far before it becomes rigid. They concluded that the chin rises up because it's pushed by the pot. What I find really cool about the mould effect is the higher you drop the chain from, the higher it loops out of the pot. Just watch what happens when I drop it from the top of my stairs. This was so much fun to do, but thank god it's over, it takes so much of those beads back into the beaker. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please remember to like and subscribe. Bye!